Trixie was, you know, like one of the first projects that I was a part of. So that ending was obviously something that was really special and like sad to be letting go of. Kristen here, and we are chatting with Scarlett Estevez all about her brand new Christmas movie, Christmas Again. We dive into our upcoming superhero show, Ultraviolet and Black Scorpion. And of course, we got to talk a little bit of Lucifer here. I hope you enjoy the conversation. I'm so excited to talk to you about this film because it really spoke to me as a Latina. I feel like I haven't seen like a young Christmas story around a Latino family before. And I was just like, oh, my heart. <laughs> so... I'm curious for you, what is your relationship like with your Latino heritage and what does it mean to you to bring a Christmas story to life that's centered on a Latino family? My culture is such a special thing and during Christmas time, there's so many things that I can relate to during this movie and even the food that we have in this movie and the songs that we sing and the dancing and the energy, it's something that I really feel like I can relate to and I think that's so real and it's coming from like a place that we can all relate to so i think that this movie was just super special because of that and there's so many things that i can be like oh my god i do that now people are going to be able to see that we do that and feel us you do so many fun things in this film so many fun holiday traditions were there any that were your favorite to film or maybe any that were super challenging there were so many things i think one of my favorite though was definitely the hockey rink i mean that was such a fun scene to film and it was crazy behind the scenes I mean, I couldn't really ice skate. So they had me on this like little platform thingy and they were dragging me across the ice. So that was super cool and super fun. What do you hope that, you know, people take away from Christmas again? Something I really want people to be able to take away from this movie is the message. And, you know, that even though that this family is changing and that there are new people coming into her life, like Louie and, you know, the new mom and all of that, I think that's something that I really want people to take away is that even though that this change is happening, that her family family is always still going to be there. Following Christmas again, you also have another really exciting Disney Channel project that's coming out. What can you tell us about Ultraviolet and Black Scorpion? It's such a, a cool TV show to be a part of because, I mean, I feel like when I was younger, I've always wanted to see a superhero that looks like me and was like me and like had so many things that I can relate to. And I feel like now people are going to be able to have that. And I think that that's something that's super special to be a part of. But yeah, this TV show, having this superhero and having Black Scorpion, um, I think it's a, a really fun TV show to be a part of. And I hope that people have as much fun as I had doing it, watching it, because it's such a special thing to be a part of. To wrap things up, I feel like I I gotta ask, you know, Lucifer just wrapped the final season. You spent so many years of your life on that set. What was it like growing up there and, and what did you learn playing Trixie? Trixie was, you know, like one of the first projects that I was a part of. So that ending was obviously something that was really special and like sad to be letting go of but it was such a special project because of it being one of the first things that I was being a part of so being able to be on that show and show people who I am in that those first stages uh, is super cool well congratulations you are killing it girl you are (laughs) thriving I'm so happy for you and congratulations on Christmas again I know people are gonna love it Thank you so much. Consider subscribing if you like my videos, and if you want to talk more TV and movies with me outside of the comments section, check out the exclusive Discord available on my Patreon at patreon.com slash kmaldo. If you like this one, you can check out more of my videos right over here. See ya!